All right, so now I've labeled my uh, spindle shaft pulley. I'm going to label my idler pulley with these as well. The largest one here is PI4, PI3, PI2, and this one is PI1. Moving over, we need to also label our motor shaft. So this one here, the very smallest one is the PM4. This is PM3. This is PM2. And our biggest one right here is PM1. Okay. So the first thing we're doing is just assigning variables to each pulley. And then we're gonna take a look at, and we know at 3100 RPM, our uh, belts basically go this way. So, and I'm just going to kind of represent those. So, we got the belts over here, and then the smaller belt goes between these two pulleys there. So, we're going to be concentrating on PSD, PI4, PI1, and PM1 are the pulleys that we're going to look at when we determine, because we know that this gives us a spindle RPM on our shaft of 3100 RPM. Here, that is our output. Our output here is 3100 RPM. We want to use what we know to determine our input. So. The next video is I will go ahead and I will show uh, how we do our calculations here with our input. So.